one of my previous videos, man, we're talking about unexpected expenses on the Roddy's. I can show you guys one right now. This is one that sucks. I showed you before they had already hit the turf up here. They already hit that spot there. Yesterday I had a, uh, who was that? Kybera and Razor out here playing around, man. Out here playing, went inside for about an hour, came back out, man. And as you guys can see, it's kind of little dips in here. They flipped up pretty much this whole piece of turf, dug a bunch of potholes in them. And uh, yeah, man, messed up the setup. Probably end up getting this fixed in January. So yeah, guys, shout out to the clients coming out, man. Not gonna be able to see the, the setup looking as supreme as it's supposed to be, but it's all good. We'll still make it work. Man, this is so annoying. Wish I knew how to lay down uh, turf. I would do it myself. And it's honestly, it's probably it's pretty simple, but I think the hardest thing is just tucking it, you know? Pulling it, getting up to this edge right here. It's probably the hardest thing. I think leveling it would be pretty easy, but just tucking it, man, it's a, it's a struggle for me to tuck it when they lift it up, so I can only imagine what it would be like doing it from uh, scratch. Oh, yeah, guys, and we got a bleeder. We got a bleeder this morning. It was actually one of our Razor daughters who we will be breeding to. I'm not sure yet. We'll see. Originally, I had planned on breeding her to that big boy Ferrari right there, but, oh, yeah, we got news too, guys, but... Our big boy Ferrari is actually going to be leaving here. He's going to be going to Florida with Janet and Adrian. They actually are the owners of Bolo and uh, Madame Doce. Bolo's from our Willow and uh, and Sergeant litter. And then Madame Doce is actually uh, Demi and Duchess' uh, sister that came from Razor and uh, our female princess. But our boy Ferrari will be going to Florida. He will be leaving uh, in roughly a week and anyone who has a stud credit with him do not worry uh the process is still going to be the same it's still going to be ship semen so everything's going to be good on that side but yeah boy ferrari will be leaving so it kind of depends on when her levels are ready i originally planned on breeding her to ferrari uh, but if he's not going to be here we'll see we might end up switching it up and going you know the heavyweight boys hulk or hannibal we got big willow hanging out back now that the, the weather's cooling down She's like, yeah, I want to come outside and play. You got big boy Razor right there. What's up? What's up, Kybera? What's up, Kybera? She's like, why are you taking so long cleaning up this poop, man? Hey, Hulk and Hannibal, come on. <whistles> come on, boys. Come on. What's up? Yeah. Love this boy, Hannibal's head type, man. Both of the boys. Love them. Hulk, Hannibal, they got it, man. Let's see that boy, Hannibal. is not as thick as Hulk right now. And he was originally the thicker boy. Um, but that's because he was down for a little bit. For about, I think, two months, I would say he was down. He had uh, slid his paw right open, straight down the middle. He was on uh, antibiotics and some more stuff, so... He did not want to eat while he was on it. We're getting him back up and wait. Getting him back, but remember guys, these pups are only 13 months. 13 month old puppies, man. Young studs. And we actually uh, just completed our first breeding with that boy Hannibal. Well, my boy uh, over there at 10-7, the owner of um, Blue Von Proctor House, and he's from our bee litter. And that's off of uh, iPod's Black Illusion and that girl princess again. 
Um, we bred uh, his female. What's up, boy? What's up, buddy? What you got, man? Let me take that. Drop it. Let me get it. Good boy. Good boy. What's up? Look at that boy. Hold. What's up? What's up? What's up? Good boy. Love you, man. What's up? Well, yeah, we ended up breeding uh, Hannibal to his female, Cammy, which you guys have seen her before. We bred her to uh, our boy Symbol once, and that's who created Lotto. So you already know it's going to be some major bangers in that litter. You know how we work. We're going to be doing a puppy back deal, so we will be keeping a female off of that litter. So I'm excited. All right. I'll be in there. Yep. Well, guys, you heard wifey saying baby girl is up. I'm about to hurry up and uh, finish cleaning up. It's time to go get some dog food, y'all. Time to go get some dog food. It's that boy, Big Hope, Von Proctor House. Let's close him up. Let's get it. We're now headed to the pit bull store to pick up our bulk odor of dog food. And I know I dropped the Ferrari news on you guys like it wasn't nothing, but I'm honestly super excited for this boy Ferrari because you guys know we have four studs here. And yes, Ferrari is a working stud. He got a lot of stud credits. He's putting out fire litters. As you guys can see, we got a very nice, heavy structure Ferrari litter here right now. Um, and he's been doing his thing. But we got four studs here. And for me, I feel like Ferrari can be the number one stud at anybody else's kennel except for here. You guys know I got Big Boy Razor, which is our top stud currently. And then we have our two young boys coming up. Hulk and Hannibal, who are actually gonna be dropping their litters here very soon. Like I just said, we will be breeding um, our girl Alpha, Von Black King to either Hulk or Hannibal. And that's if and only if our boy Ferrari has already left. Um, but yeah, you guys know, we got these young studs coming up right now. And I think it's the best time for him to go somewhere else and be that number one stud, you know, in somebody else's yard. Um, and he is going to be going on a co-own, so I will be, st I still will be studying him out. If you guys want to use him, tap in with me, still be able to use him. Um, and I will be using him for future breedings here uh, as well. But I just think it's best at this time for him to go somewhere else and be that top dog. background noise i got my baby girl riding with me and she let it talk but the main reason why i'm super excited about our big boy ferrari headed out on co-owned is because we're at a pivot point with our studs and like i said our big boy razor is currently our number one stud we're actually putting hulk and hannibal and our future productions in positions to take over that number one spot and become the face of proctor house rottweilers we're getting ready to pull up to the pit bull store so let's grab this dog food guys Yeah, I'm gonna be the face of this thing, huh? Big Hulk Von Proctor House. 13 month old designer gorilla doing his thing. He's like, what is all this extra noise back here? Trucks. <laughs> What's up, buddy? What's up, buddy? Size on that boy head. The size of that boy neck. Look at that neck, man. Look how thick he is. Thick rears. All the bags loaded up. Let's get it, guys. This is our girl, Alpha Von Black King. She's off of Luna Timotor and our big boy, Razor Timotor. And Luna is actually the sister of uh, Simba Timotor, the stuff that we have right now, currently on co-own. 
guys can see, man, she got a great look on her. And I know for a fact, my boys Hulk and Hannibal are gonna throw it. Yeah, I know, boy. I know for a fact that our boys Hulk and Hannibal are gonna throw that size on her. Throw that crazy gorilla look, man. Yeah, I see she got it. She got that razor type, head type. And I post her pedigree here. What's up, Ferrari? What's up, buddy? 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 Big boy. What's up, buddy? She is also the sister of our female Africa Von Black King. Littermate sisters. So you guys know we about to drop some heavyweights, man. <laughs> 